Let n and m be two positive integers such that they are exactly 41 integers greater than 8 power m and less than 8 power n, right? which can be expressed as powers of 2. Okay, nice. So, 8 power m greater than x power m, 8 power m and less than 8 power m. So, fine. 41 integers that can be expressed as powers of 2. Fine. So, so, this is 2 power something, 41 different values. Nice. Then the smallest possible value of n plus m is nice. So 8 power m and 8 power 8 power m, 8 power n in between these two, bunch of powers of 2 are sitting there. Right? First of all, this is 2 power 3m less than 2 power something less than 2 power 3n. So between 3m and 3n, between say 9 and 36. And some two values. Right? So, 3m and 3n. How many different values can there be? So, let's say we are looking at numbers from say 2, 2 power 9, less than 2 power something, less than 2 power 21. How many values can n take? 10, 11, 12, 3, 21. 21 minus 9, 21 minus 9 is 12. So there can be 12 different values, there can be 11 different values. Nice. So, it's a very important adjustment because otherwise this 41 won't come. When I did this question, I did 3n minus 3m and said 3 times n minus m, how is it going to be 41? It's not 3 times n minus m, it is 3n minus 3m minus 1 because it is in between, it's greater than this and less than that. So, now we get quite beautifully 3n minus 3m minus 1 equals 41 or 3 times n minus m is 42 n minus m is 14. What are the smallest values of m plus n? n minus m is 14. Uh, all we need to m and 2 be two positive integers. So, m could be 1. m is 1 in which case n is 15. 1 plus 15, 16. Done. Once we find the difference, plugging it in is far simpler. Doable question. Hush.